so today uh, we are going to see how I prepare my kid in the morning and also I, as I prepare myself because I'm, I have some work to do today I'm going to work so come with me and we see how I'm going to things are going to take place one by one so Hope you've watched my videos, some of my videos that you've not. Hope you really subscribe to my channel. Like, comment, and share. Tell me what you think. So these are going to start our day today. As a, yes, as a mom, this is how we're going to start our day today. As I prepare my kid to go to school. And also as I prepare myself to go to work. So this is how I start my day beside waking up. First of all, I put you on the macro on my gas to cook. Yes, meanwhile, as the tea is uh, heating up or cooking up or boiling up, I have to ensure that I take care of my living room. And as you can see, it's all messed up. This is because I had a baby shower held in my house. And um, apparently, I did not remove everything. I just removed the things at night. And this is where I had to leave them. Because I was really tired. Uh, I had the field work the previous day. So I was really tired. And right now, I'm trying to clean up to ensure that my living room looks clean before anything else. So uh, before I leave my house, I ensure that my house is really clean. So let's get, let's get this done. I wanna wake up with you in the morning Say what you wanna say to me now I wanna wake up with you in the morning Some of this ain't fake to me now I wanna wake up with you in the morning But we can, we can do nothing, do nothing at all So what, so what, if you're stupid and you So there's something about these dolls uh, as much as I take them out of my living room, my son always picks them back to their living room from the rooms inside. So I just had to accommodate them here. So right now we have to do the brushing of my carpet. Since I cannot remove it out, it's still early in the morning, 6 a.m. and I have to uh, clear up. Most of the days I always remove the carpet, uh, dust it out and wipe the whole living room. So today we have to wipe it off using a brush no washing because the house is not that dirty so yes let's continue with cleaning as you see i'm ensuring that uh, all the corners that are visible i clean them out and we are done dusting so finally at the far end of my living room trying to undust my carpet as i've done the cleaning and we continue with the cleaning so you see um i'm really so amazed with how i'm trying to fix in between motherhood and working and ensuring that the house is clean by the time i'm leaving the house yes this is when duty when, what do you say when mother duty calls at home and you have to go and work so hard yeah so at the final end this is how it looks i've not removed the bag and my jacket because i'll be putting on my jacket when i'm going to work and as for my son's bag we're going to school with it so anyway finding uh clearing up uh, my living room uh, being neat i'm finishing up with wiping the dining before all set is all is set for breakfast yes this is how we are doing the cleaning <laughs> As you've seen, I've used a kitchen towel. Yes, I always use it after wiping with water. Uh, there's always a water that I use. And guys, do you always get this mess all the time? It's always hectic to multitask, but what do I say? I just have to wipe off, then we continue cooking our tea. Because one thing with me, I cannot cook in a gas that has already poured tea. So I have to clean it up and we continue. So we're done. And this is the end product of my tea. So don't worry as much as my video is not clear. My tea has cooked well. And uh, my son always ensure the tea is left on the sufuria, my pot, for it to cool, for him to be able to drink it. So meanwhile, as everything is said, the breakfast, the tea is ready. My living room, in, room is clean. I've woken up. Time to pack my son's school bag. 
and uh, also to put his uh, uh, uniform like games kits aside because today is a games day and this is what they are wearing they are wearing tracksuit to school so I had to put them aside and first pack his bag I didn't do anything as I've told you earlier because I was really exhausted I was so tired and uh, today on the diary and like the school activity of this time today they are supposed to have a swimming cl uh, classes so we are supposed to pack kids swimming costume on the bag and uh, some snacks for the kid if fruits are there you add them on the bag then uh, yes the kid is ready to go to school yes so this is how we are packing it you seen i've changed the bag i've just realized that the bag is too small to fit in all the things that i needed to be fitting so this is one so uh, the soda i've packed a soda for him and also this other bottle carries water it's not that clear i, I think i didn't set my camera right anyway i've logged a uh, life uh, uh, here we have the swimming costume so initially you will see me putting closing it then unpacking it so i was torn in between putting the boxer or not since he had his uh, swimming trousers, so that's how I decided to pack at the end of it all. And uh, I always have a weakness. I don't know if I'm the only person who always forget to look at the diary at, in in the evening beside everything else. So I I understand there's too much to do. So I just checked the diary. I did not sign it, but he did the assignment. So you have to send the diary. Then I realized, not I realized, I knew they were supposed to go for swimming. So I did not send the money. So I decided to put it in the diary in the middle, fold it and put it well in the bag so that the teacher can get it there. Though I had to call the teacher and tell her. So this is how you go about it. So it's an easy way. So the snacks they are packing for my son, ensuring that the snacks are well kept in a Ziploc bag. Yeah, and uh, this top, this other one that I've put aside, he kept it there. It wasn't for his uh, swimming uh, day snack, so I had to remove it. Now, parenting at its peak. Waking up my son in the morning is always a hectic thing. So, I waking up, it takes time. First of all, I always ensure to wake him up so well so that he doesn't disturb me. I wash his face first. I wash his face to wake him up. But uh, you'll see on this video something very funny. So wanting to brush his teeth, then my son, boom, he wants the brush. So he, I don't allow him to brush his teeth right every day, uh, once in a while. And I did not see this. You see, he's almost falling. I didn't see this. I don't know. And I have seen my son always use his, the hand towel to wipe his face. So setting this camera here has helped me. This is my CCTV. So <laughs> parenting. So I've realized this So. This is something you need to work on. We have a plenty of face towel, but now I've realized this is what he uses. He has a problem. Then I'll show you another problem that he has. So he's brushing his teeth, though not every day. Most sometimes I do. Most of the time, I'm the one who brushes his teeth. Yes. Yeah, so once in a while, teaching him that's how he learn. You've seen him wiping his hands on his cloth. This is what my son does every day. Even when he has food on his hand, and prod and end place of wiping is his cloth i've really tried i don't know how you can help me to deal with this right there on top of the moon we could sit and do nothing i wish we were both to just fly away I don't wanna care It's being I'm good Alone I'll be okay Miss you like an old friend Too scared now Thinking I should call up I'm not I think it's hard 
How we always wait another day. How we was good mothers. Aish, out there, am I the only person who always struggle with a kid in the morning to dress up? Uh, my son dresses himself up, always prefer dressing himself up. Yeah, I mean it. But now the problem with him dressing himself, he'll take a lot of time. Like, I don't know, you should wake him up 30 minutes before time, but it's too slow for me and even time to go to school. Yani, who wanna jivruta sana? And to avoid all that, I decide to dress him up. So we are done dressing, now it's time to take breakfast and since there's no time i leave my son here as he takes his breakfast then i go and uh, do i do i'd like i'd go and prepare myself since i've not done anything for myself and time is ticking it's really late and i don't want to be late for work I'm done dressing and since I'm going to a field work, I have to carry some snacks. Not snacks, I can say a munch. And I've decided to make some eggs for myself and bread. I love brown bread. So, uh, yes, I love brown bread. Just that I eat it um, uh, rarely, but I love it. So, just spreading out. The one that I'll take tea with then later on, I'll be doing an egg, which is one egg only. I always ensure that I don't eat more than one egg anytime I want to take breakfast as egg. So this one, I'll be able to put it into my slices of bread as you'll see on the video. And if you've come this far, thank you so much. I'm so humbled. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like, comment, share, tell me what you think about my videos. And uh, I'll try so hard to feed you with videos so that you can feel the same way I'm feeling, like you feel you're just here when I'm doing my activities. And as you can see, my eggs are ready. I'll uh, dry off uh, excess oil. Then I put them into my slices of bread. And we are good to go. As you can see, first I've packed the other one that I've already spread. And now we have to put the eggs in between the other slice. Then I wrap it up so well so that I can take it to work. So this is more of a lunch for me. Yes. And we are good to go for the day. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and tell me what you think about my awesome videos.
school. I've already finished dressing up my son. Yes, I'm dropping him to school as I go to work. Yeah.